हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज अबाउट आई एन आर फोर इंटीग्रेटेड नाइनटीन सब्जेक्ट रिविजन नंबर फोर वेयर वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट एन एन सिफेली एंड द फ्रॉग आई साइन राइट सो वॉट इज एन एन सिफेली एन एन सिफेली इज अ एबसेंस ऑफ मेजर पोर्शन ऑफ ब्रेन स्कल और स्कल राइट सो इट इज द इज द एबसेंस ऑफ द ब्रेन स्कल और स्कैल्प and this is a cephalic disorder which results from the neural tube defect remember this is from the neural tube defect and which occurs when the rostral end of the neural tube fails to close remember what i am saying rostral means head end so head end of the neural tube fails to close then we will see this kind of anencephaly right and when it will happen usually it will happen between the 23rd and 26th days after the conception right so this is what you have to remember so this will occur after 23 to 26 day of the conception what can be the reason for this anencephaly that is also important so reason for anencephaly is folic acid deficiency that is why you might be you know prescribing folic acid when a pregnant female is coming for antenatal visit so that we can avoid this anencephaly this is the clinical correlation i'm telling you right so you are giving folic acid to that patient or in that patient you are avoiding folate antagonist also like a trimethoprim or methotrexate right so in anencephaly as you can see in this baby the cephalic portion is missing and this missing cephalic portion when you will see the radiological examination you can see there is no cephalic area and this baby is looking like a frog eye right so you can see frog eye sign that is why it is called as frog eye sign so anencephaly will show frog eye sign number 1 it is the absence of brain skull and scalp because of the lack of fusion of the rostral end of the neural tube defect on 23rd to 26th days after the conception and remember folic acid deficiency and folate antagonist like a trimethoprim or methotrexate are the reason best wishes for your exam and keep watching all these lectures